Our street is called Hue de Marques de Olivia. Kind of interesting little corner here. We're gonna explore that a little bit more. There's like the Thai restaurant right there. There's a nice little back courtyard in there. So we're gonna be walking down this street. Oh dang! We also got that cool looking look right there. And I didn't really notice that that's the street that we're gonna be doing. So we're gonna go behind us, check that out, check out the entrance of it. Then we're gonna stroll on down this little street right here. Hey, after you watch this, tell me what you like most about it. Put it in the comments below. Also, make sure that you like, subscribe, and hit that little bell button so you can see when I make other videos too. Okay, let's head on up this way. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to come up to the front. There's that little Buddhist one. So we have this little courtyard right here, followed by the um, fire station, the Bomberos. So that's it right there, the Bomberos. Copo, Copo de, de Bomberos, the um, like fire station. They've got lots of cool stuff everywhere around here. I want to focus on our street, which is down this little alley to the right there. But I also really like that building right there. That one right there, you can see it. I think it doesn't hurt just to highlight this building and then just highlight that building. And then we're gonna come back and do our focus one. But that building right there, I just think it looks so cool. It's this little narrow one that's like kind of hidden on the wall. Yeah, that one right there. Dang. Kind of wish I was filming that street. I will later though. That's called Teresa dos Bomberos, so later, maybe another time we'll film that one. Teresa dos Bomberos, thanks to the Bomberos. Yeah, I really like that building. I've um, noticed, I've always admired that one. I've always thought it was really cool. So anyways, we're going to be coming back to our Target Street. And I don't mind getting off track a little bit, just to give you some context of where we are with stuff and just so you can kind of see. That's going to be our focus, but we're going to start from the very, very start of the street. By the time I get down to the end of the street, I might not do this Pompeiros at all, but at least, at least you got to see that building. You can always see a request for it and I'll go back and do it. So now we're coming back to our focus street, which is right here. Yeah, that one right there is, that looks so cool too, that building. Just even the rooftop way up there. Like if you're up, if you're up there, you kind of had like a, you could view all the different sides. Yeah, it's so cool. There's so many interesting apartments everywhere around here. Yeah, I really like that a lot. I, I like that Bomberos one, but I also like this one right here. Like just imagine if you lived in, like I bet, I bet like this whole thing, you'd have both sides, you'd have three sides. So you'd really, uh, I don't know, it'd be kind of interesting, I think. The Bomberos over there. I'm gonna keep on walking down. Another thing I like about this particular street is that we have um, one side without any parked cars. So that means I can capture the street much better that way. All we really need now is, um, there's a, I'm gonna walk this way. All we need now is more uh, people. Looks like an interesting shop too. Okay. So let's just see what all we can see down here. Um, huh. That red gated place looks unusual right there. It's like really strong gates. Like it looks like it's made out of like metal, like heavy metal, just to be able to. Sometimes they're like really thin metal, like those, but that one is like a really strong metal. Looks like you could go out there and um, and actually use it as a balcony. Kind of interesting. Okay, so we're gonna keep on strolling down. Let's see what we can see. Cross streets. Walk out into the street for a moment. Got some beauty shops. 
kind of quite sweet. Some residential areas in here. I don't think I don't recall having filmed the street before. I remember. Let's see. Some of the side streets stuff. Such things. It's kind of hard, you're kind of, kind of navigating a lot of different things in here. Sometimes I see something that I want to film, but I'm on a narrow sidewalk with cars going by and people everywhere. So sometimes it's a little bit of a challenge to adequately film everything I see. Plus I'm also, today I'm on, on a Sunday and Sundays I'm usually uh, watching kids. So I'm watching a kid right now, and I'm holding like that, so he doesn't go into the street. And then I'm going into the street myself, like this, to balance it all. Okay, so we're gonna keep on walking down. I think we're gonna come out into a pretty busy little area. There's a common room. I've been in here in a while, but there used, used to be like a Medan Indonesian restaurant right over there. And it looks like it's now it's closed. Let's see if we can get around in here. Close to the parka. Okay, there's Maxim's. It's a bakery. And as you see, I think that this ends, and I think the next street is called Restoration, like Restoration Street. Yeah, I think it is. So that was our focus street right there. And now we're on Hula de Barca. You got some alleys like that. And then, yeah, this is Rosa Rochelle Street. And I kind of like this kind of cool looking green building right there too. So that building kind of reminds me of the start of the other one. And if you check this out too, like you can see those balconies like that. I just how cool those ones. Like I thought the other ones were kind of cool, but those are even better. And our focus street was uh, this one right here, and at the top, I think that's Kumu Hospital up there. So you can see that one. So we're gonna focus, and we're gonna end this video right here on the spot. Let's go check out the room. Oh, hey guys, three things: like, subscribe. Make some comments below, it'll really help out my channel. Alright.